the British better than other people? Well, we haven't been defeated. So you are better. We've stood up for what we believed in. But what I hate more than anything else in the world is what Hitler stands for. But you did, did you fight against him? Well, I wasn't born. Did your I people like fight to. against him? I would, li I would like to. I would like to have said that my people have So you him. admit that as a matter of fact, it was America, Canada and Britain that land on the Normandy beaches. Yes. France I had been defeated. But, listen, but I didn't uh, get the question. Spain was under fascism. Italy had been under fascism. So you admit all of those things. Yes. And then I'm you say, well, you don't like it if we say we are better. I say we were better at standing up against tyranny. And that is fact. And that is the lesson of history. Yes, but that wasn't the question from the beginning. I was just going to say that to me, what Hitler stood for is the, the worst that, uh, I mean, is the worst in history. But to me, it is uh, a person or a people saying that our people is better than any other people. But what are you saying by better? What I am saying is as a matter of fact, it was the Anglo-American alliance that stood up and fought the tyranny which you hate. So did Norway. So did Denmark. So it's the Scandinavians as well who what stood up and fought. What do you think of Sweden? Sweden was neutral. What do you think of Sweden? I think if people had been neutral against Hitler, Hitler would have won. If people had been neutral against Stalin, Stalin would have won. So you think that Sweden was No, I am not going to go coward. and say any more. I just have one last request. Uh, all the people that I interview, I ask them to do something for me. It's kind of a gimmick on my show, uh, and it's to make a jump, just to stand up and make a jump up in the air. I shouldn't dream of doing that. Why should I? Well, I it's, see it's no significance whatsoever of making a jump up in the air. I made great leaps forward, not little jumps in studios. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I just won a bet, because where I work, everybody betted whether you should make a jump or not. And Certainly I, not. And I was almost the only one who said that you would never do it. Shouldn't dream. I think it's a silly thing to ask. Yes. I think it's a puerile thing to ask. Yes. And Gorbachev did it. Well, you amaze me. Yes? I wonder what he thought of the politics of a free society, if that's what they ask you to do. <laughs> <laughs> well, a lot of people find it, you know, just amusing. It's just, it's just a way of showing another side of people, you know, because the people I interview are so used to talking and talking. But when I, I wasn't used to talking, I was used to doing. <laughs>